hey guys welcome back to another video of geek blade youtube channel so in this video i am going to tell you how you can access windows subsystem for android files i mean how you can access wsa file location so it's important to access wsa file location if you want to transfer obv or any other files in your windows subsystem for android to install on your android system so, okay so if you want to access wsa file location then you cannot directly access wsa file location from your file exploration windows 11 file explorer to do that first you have to install a simple sm first you have to create a smb server and after that you can use windows 11's network drive tool to access that smb server okay so let me show you how you can do that first do open play store search for smb server open first app called a land drive samba server and client do install this app in your windows 11 pc so you don't have to sideload this application it's available officially on google play store if you don't know how i have installed google play store in my windows 11 pc then please do check out my previous video i have already mentioned how you can do that okay so i have opened land drive application now just click on users after that can click on anonymous and then select users with rights after that click on plus icon to add user now we, here i am going to add user information let me show you on full screen okay okay now i am going to enter user information you can enter any information you want for example i am entering geek bullet and in password i am entering password just to demonstrate okay after that make sure you have enabled right permission of from global permission section after allowing right permission wait application got close let me open it again okay this app has some issue if you use this application on full screen then it will get closed automatically so i'm going to add again information Hopefully this time it will work. Okay, I'm no, not gonna cut down this video so that you can see what's going on. Unable write permission. Make sure you are you enable global write permission from global permission section. Click on save option. Let's say you have created a users with read and write permission. Okay, now go back to main screen of application. Now you will see a star button here click on it click on allow okay now you need this ip address shown here yours will be different okay so now open file manager click on here now i am going to type the same ip address shown your ip address will be different as per you create users okay now i am going to press enter is gonna ask my username and password that I have entered before. Okay, so make sure you re remember username and password that you have entered before. Okay, remember. Do check this option as well. Click on OK. That's it. Now click on Root. Now go to Stories. After it, go to Emulated and go to Zero. Okay, so here are all Android files, Windows subsystem for Android file. Make sure you don't stop this SMB server, else you will not able to access your network drive of Windows subsystem for Android. Okay, let me show you how you can transfer OBB data. Click on an open Android folder, then go to OBB folder. If you want to transfer any files here, just drag and drop here, and it will get transferred. It might take time to transfer files because it's an network drive not you are not accessing um, storage locally okay we have to wait it, I'm just showing how it will it's just work I know it's, it's taking too much time but it will work this method 
as of now you cannot install any any file explorer application and use it normally because you need write permission read and write permission and window and window subsystem for android currently not allow it okay so let me show you once again where is your files all files once you access your your network drive through ip address you have to first open root folder after that you have to, you have to open storage folder and after that emulate it and then zero okay so from here you can access all windows of system for android files one there is one more way to access these files go to root then go to sd card from here you can access all windows of system for android files so there are two directory in which you can find these files okay so you can use any of any of these directory if you open if if you directly drive to open internal storage from here then you can you will not able to copy and paste files here you will only able to see files okay so if you want to transfer files then you have to go to first root and then you can you have to go to either sd card or either storage to access windows of system for android files so that's how you can access the windows of system for uh, for android files and here is your ws file location hope you find this video helpful if you do then please like and comment on this video also please subscribe to my youtube channel so that i can make more content like this thank you guys for watching this video